Hello everyone, Sam is here from creativecreatingsystems.com uh, making this a small video about our trades taken yesterday and today, Monday and Tuesday. So let's get started here. And also I'm going to give you a very good setup uh, for you know to trade uh, tomorrow. Okay, so let's get started here. Um, first trade is pound USD. And I said I recorded it on the 8th, but you notice that the entry was on last Friday. Uh, it did move much on Friday, so I said, okay, let me hold it uh, over the weekend, and let's see what happened. And we, over the weekend, this, this three-drive pattern here, and there's a big reason that I closed this uh, here. I'm going to show you uh, a little uh, later. So this one for 75 pip, and the other one also same thing um on the eighth and it is from um the my laptop and um that's why the chart is a little different and it is for 75 pip okay so um they both went up but now uh let me show you one more here from seven minute chart euro aussie all the way down from here for 95 plus pip this is my uh son's computer so these are the three, only three uh, trade because the market has been very, very, very slow Monday and Tuesday. Why? Because there is no news schedule. Uh, let me show you uh, the first factory, uh, the calendar. You will see here, see Monday, starting Sunday, and then Monday is all yellow, and then here is a black, uh, I mean, bank holidays, it's, you know, pound and euro. Uh, and then from there is all yellow, yellow, yellow. Tuesday all day, no uh, orange or red news, and that's why uh, market just did move. Yellow news uh, don't you know weigh too much. So uh, now on Wednesday tomorrow, we gonna have this China news, which I don't pay attention to because I don't trade any Chinese pair. But notice that on eight thirty a.m. Uh, we have a couple of news, red news, for the first time in this week. Uh, 8.30 USD news, CPI, and it is uh, it was 0.1, but they're expecting 0.4. So they're expecting uh, more than before. And that will, if that happened, if the news come out like that, or better than that, then USD probably going to get strong. And then what happened? Euro USD, pound USD, all of that, they will have a chance to drop. So based on this, let's see, I'm going to give you a US dollar, I mean a pound USD chart. This is the chart of the week. It's going to be, if the USD news came, uh, come out better than expected, USD is going to get strong, and then you can see what is happening here, this tier. By the way, I made this chart like, uh, on a week ago, on the 29th April, uh, marking here, like from here, I said it's going to go up, hit the TL, and then drop. So it went up and hit the TL. Right now, you can see here, it is touching the TL and posting a doji there, right? So if that, if we close uh, like that, and uh, like I said, if you, tomorrow morning, 8.30, USD news come out better than expected. USD is going to get strong, and this thing will drop. So be prepared. Be ready. I'm going to take my trade, and this is uh, one of them I'm showing, but all the others are also setting up. Some other pairs, you know, USD pairs, I'm talking about Euro USD and you know, USD Yen, USD CAD, right? So they're all going to move based on the USD strength. But this is the one that I'm giving you. Um, be careful, be ready. Uh, as long as we stay below the TL and below this 2678, we're going to drop. So I'm going to use my strategy, my I mean, uh, system uh, to take the entries, which is uh, obviously this one. So if it's going to drop and then give me short entry. This is the trade that I just showed you that I took, right? So um, yeah, it, this is the entry, long entry. I mean, this was a long entry here, 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 here. Now, if USD gets strong, this thing is going to drop here and then give me short entries, right? So whatever the system you use, use and uh, try to take advantage of this chart. And uh, this is how it is. This current chart, again, is ready to drop. If USD gets news any better than expected, it's going to drop, all right? So this is it for now. 
And if you uh, want to get this system uh, and trade like I do here in my group, then go to my website, uh, this creative trading system.com and uh, get it from there and set up your charts and start trading. All right. So bye for now. And don't forget to subscribe the channel. All right. So I'll give out uh, once in a while uh, or, or pretty often time. I'm, I give out the, the setups like this one. So you can take advantage of those. All right. So uh, if you subscribe, you're going to get my videos as soon as I upload them and you can take advantage. All right. So bye for now and talk to you guys later.